Alright everybody, welcome back to part 12 of Fire Emblem Path of Radiance. Last time, we got attacked by Raven Pirates at sea, and we had to fend them off on a boat, and the Prince of Goldoa had to help us out, and now we're back in the ocean. We also recruited South, and not much else happened, but let's get right into the episode, because there's really nothing much that happened last episode. It was a chill episode last time. <coughs> Chapter 13, A Guiding Wind. It's actually uh, one of my favorite chapters of the game. It's actually pretty well designed. And there's actually like no dialogue in this chapter. You just get right into the preps. Uh, that's literally it. So. Let's see the info. Okay, so, actually pay attention to that conversation. I, I should have mentioned this earlier, but that conversation is very, very important to this chapter. It's like a, it's like a, how do I explain it? Like a dead giveaway of a hint of how this chapter will be. Like, he literally explains the strategy of how to beat this chapter before it even happens. He gives you the scenario of what this chapter is and what the best scenario is for beating it. Fun fact, this is actually, I think, the first time you meet, you meet Annie, which is weird, because, uh, you think you meet her earlier, but no. Oh, it looks like it's raining, too. Nice. Oh man, that's funny. All right, so here we got Jill.
So, they were actually basically hinting towards a mechanic that only they can do the triangle attack later on in the game, but you can't do it yet. But it's, pre but it's uh, pretty interesting how it gets uh, hinted at this early. It'll give you an idea. Let's see... Okay, so I already have uh, Soren to see. Alright. Tania, Mist, uh. Not really a lot to work with here. I don't have any skills. Do I have any XP? Yeah, I got a little bit. Alright. Ideally. Man, I don't know, it's either between Soren or Mia, because, uh... Volk, I can give him some XP a little bit later. We're still good for right now. I guess I could give Mia some XP, and then Soren. Well, at least she got some defense and speed and skill, but... Strength would have been nice. Okay, let's see what we got here. Level 16? Okay, that's what I'm talking about. Magic and speed. Okay, let's see. Uh, I guess gonna need a new sword. So definitely gonna have to buy that. He's not gonna need a steel sword. I don't think so anyway. He's already pretty good. Iron, steel, iron. Void's pretty much set. So is Oscar. Soren's still pretty good. Titania's good too. Okay, Mia's got a secret book. Um. Uh, I could probably end. I should probably give that to Nephany. I think. Hold up. I need to check uh, her her stats real quick. Okay, her skill is fourteen. Let me compare that to Boyd. Hmm. I don't know, but let's try giving it to Boyd, I guess. And I'll give that Seraph rope to Nephany, because uh, she could use some XP. I mean, not XP, but HP. Right, let me check his stats. Okay, there we go. Now he's got the same skill as Nephany. Um. All right, so who had that? Or oh, yeah, Mia had it. Uh, here we go. There we go, 31 HP. There we go. She should at least be able to uh, do more. Z-Hark. Where's Miss that? Ah, here she is. Uh, she's actually still good for right now. Jill, on the other hand, needs uh, an iron weapon. Go, let me buy one more. Okay, I think I'm good for right now, now though. Uh, now, Z-Hark. 
where is me? End up trading that that steel killing edge and that's slim sword. There we go. Steel sword and killing edge for Mia. And I think we're ready. Just quick preparations, but I think we are set for this chapter. Ah, uh, Tanith. Oh, this here's a good line. That's pretty funny. I think it even gets mentioned in the next game too, if I remember correctly.
Look who it is. Gay tree. If you paid attention to that one conversation, that scenario that uh, George was talking about, or Daniel, I forgot his name, should uh, be looking awfully familiar right about now. Except uh, he left out the part with the Ravens, but uh, we'll get to that. So, three planks. Uh, this is a 10, you get a defend for 10 turns. So, although I will probably try, just try to kill them all, just get all that XP that I can get. It's a lot of it. Okay, we got a Hilberdier here. Javelin. Alright. So, Gaytree's back. Pretty straightforward. So we, But there's another unit. Astrid. Let's see. Okay, so... I'm gonna talk about Astrid a little bit later. Once I recruit her. We got two treasure chests here. I think there's actually uh, two more. Yeah, two more... Oh, actually, yeah, here's more. Yeah, it's actually quite a few treasure chests. Volk should have a pretty decent time here. Or south if you, for some reason, deployed him. And he, we finally meet Norris. Level 5 sniper. Comes with a longbow and a steel bow. Nasty. And adept, of course. Um, Alright, so who am I deploying for this map? Probably gonna bench Z Hark, honestly. But I'll probably pr bring Riss just for that extra healing, as that'll be a little bit more helpful. Okay, who do I want on the front? This should be good. Okay, this is looking really good. There we go. That's more like it. <clears throat> Two healers, and uh, Titania's going to be a little bit in the back. We don't need her at the front immediately. Alright. So, this is a 10 turn defense. If uh, they get right here, game over. Just going to let y'all know. Okay, so first things first, let's get rid of this soldier. As I think that's going to be... Probably the, the first thing we need to do. <laughs> you recruit Gaytree with Ike, by the way, so if uh, you have any questions about that, now you know. Uh,. Okay. Jill shouldn't have a problem with oh, I need to be careful. That's the archers. Okay, there's only one. It's not that big of a deal. She is level 8 though, so keep that in mind. But uh hopefully this will be a good chapter for her to catch up. Alright, uh, let's see. Oh yeah, forgot about this part.
Wow. <laughs> that stain, of course, the ones we're attacking. Okay. Yeah, so just kind of use the green units as, like, decoys, if you will. You want to keep them alive as possible, because they're actually... They'll do a little bit of chip damage here and there, but they're mostly just, like, body bags, really. All right. That dude's definitely dead. I think the left side is honestly going to be the hardest to defend, probably because of the total amount of units that there are in that one part. Okay, we got the ravens coming in. Yeah, be careful with the ravens, too. They will actually kind of move in towards the green zone. It's weird because they don't actually... They don't actively try to, but if they're close enough, the AI will actually go there. I've had that happen to me a couple times. They just kind of go for the treasure chest, but if for whatever reason, like, uh, they get, like, close enough to the green zone, it actually goes for it, which is actually interesting. Okay... Oh, thank you, Gaytree. Really glad he moved there. Alright. Let's talk to him. Gaytree. It won't recruit him right away. I think it talked to, uh, what's her name? Uh, shoot, I can't even remember her name. Uh, that one girl, Astrid, yeah, there we go. I can remember her name. I'll kind of have left move up here just to, like, prevent these guys from moving. Okay. Oh my god, he one-shots this dude. Jesus. What are these guys level? Okay. That's probably why. Okay. I was about to say, oh, I need to make sure that none of these guys got some weird weapons that can one-shot Oscar. Okay. Steel bow, gotta watch out for that. Hammer, okay. G Gatry, he's got to watch out for that, for sure. Fire, killing edge, okay, there he is. I knew there was one, because I remember there was like a killing edge dude. So, here he is. Steel bow, thunder, thunder, okay. We also got these birds. Try to kill them if you can before they take any of the items, if you really want them, you know. Be quick about that. I'm going to have Jill get rid of this guy. Yeah, you kind of see the issue with Jill here. 
she doesn't really do a good job of doubling. But that's alright, because uh, hopefully she can finish this guy off. Let's pop out the Iron Lance. Hopefully she hits. Nice. Not quite a level up though, unfortunately. I'll move like this. Let's go with wind. This would be a pretty decent chapter for Soren to get some kills. Alright, we got Volk here. I'm gonna have uh, Volk open this treasure chest before that dude tries to swoop in and take it. Killer bow, okay. If you're using Rolf for whatever reason, I mean, he's not bad, but if you're using him, that's actually a pretty good weapon for him to get early on in the game. Alright. Going for this guy. He's gonna double. Alright. Not that big of a deal. Ah, okay. Ouch. Thunder's not going to be a big deal for Leth. Just watch her for the fire. Okay. Nice dodge, Nephany. Ooh. This guy went for Volk. Get rid of this guy, Boyd, if you can. Okay. No, don't steal that kill. Thank you. Aha. Ah, come on, Astrid. What are you doing? Okay. You don't double him, do you? Okay, good. A little bit worried there. Talk to her. All right, sweet. Let's do this here. And Ike, I mean Ike, but Boyd can probably take care of this guy? Let's find out. Okay. Yeah, hopefully he can take him out. There's a lot of units here. I'm gonna have to. I don't know if I should move Titania just yet. But Soren needs to absolutely take care of this guy right now. Oh yeah, he's got this. Thank you. These birds can be annoying. We got a coin from them. All right. I'm going to pop a Vulnerary because I actually don't want Mr. Rolf getting near the Ravens. That'll be bad news if that happens. <coughs> okay, we got a couple guys here. I wonder if they're wounded, though. Okay, what? Let's try this. That's where the Killing Edge is probably better. Okay, I need to check the range of this dude.
recruit Gaytree with Estrid. There we go, that works. <laughs> I'm an ideal role model. Yo. All oh, right, I forgot Astrid. Uh, geez. All right, let's talk about Astrid then. So Astrid, you're probably thinking, whoa, level one bow knight. She must be promoted to join like that in this chapter, right? Yeah. No. So, let's talk about this real quick. So, Astrid joins us a level 1 Bow Knight, and no, that is not a pre-promoted class. That is a regular class. So, yeah. <clears throat> She's, she has 20 HP right off the bat. And if you're looking at those stats, that should be an obvious hint that that is not a pre-promoted class. She does get plus 2 stats to her defense and resistance, but that's because of the Knight Ward. However... She does have one redeeming quality, despite joining late, like this. Paragon. Crap. Here we go. Paragon. It doubles the experience points she will gain. She will level up so quick, she'll probably cap out in four chapters if you grind it. Like, I'm not joking. Just, uh, it's a little bit tricky right now, but if you really train her, she gets really good really quick, just like she did in Radiant Dawn. She has that same skill. She does turn into a good unit, but, uh, it's kind of hard at first because she starts off pretty low level. Other than that, that's Astrid. And Gaytree is Gaytree, so pretty straightforward, really. Let's see if I can get rid of this guy. Come on, Gaytree. Who's that? All right, King. I'll screw get rid of this guy. <laughs> yes, good. Because that would have been a problem otherwise. I don't think she can kill this dude. But Jill can get this guy, and that's a level up for Jill. Get some good stats. Oh, she got defense. Defense is good. And she got some HP. I guess I can't complain too much there. Uh, what to do? What to do? I guess I could blockade this side like this. Wait, what does this dude have? Oh, he's got javelin. That's why. Javelin, and these guys all have javelins. Bird. I'm about to make wrist retreat for now. Hopefully, I didn't mess up here. Okay, I'm for Anthony. Go, this guy's down. Ooh, level up for left. Level 5. Oh, those, that is an amazing level up. Okay, ah, uh, oh wait. I got panicked there. I thought it was a bow guy for a second. Shoot. Soren, take this guy. Show him his boss. Yes, you double. Volk could actually kill this dude now. If he... Okay. Who's left? No, 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 no. Don't, do not kill this dude, please. Thank you. <laughs> uh, 
Alright, we'll do this. Boom. Astro probably could have killed that dude too. I'm gonna move over this way. Short axe. Do I wanna do that? Nah. I don't wanna waste that. Need back my iron axe. What I will do is this. Alright, hold on, hold on. Before I do that. Yeah, let's not do that. Let's not do that. There we go. We get him a little bit at least. Hmm. Yeah, okay. Pretty good. Okay, now that I did that. Uh, where is Soren? Did he? Did I move him already? Yeah, I did. Let's heal up Soren. And let's get Riss back up. What's this looking like? Yeah, I'd rather not do that. Sounds like a bad idea. <laughs> okay, we're still on turn, on turn four, but I want to get all those sweet, sweet items. If I can. Ouch. Man, this guy hits hard. Strength. Nice. And some speed and skill. So that's pretty good. Okay, going after Boyd. Doesn't quite double, though. Okay. We got more birds. Watch out for that. Uh. Okay, thank you, Boyd. A little bit worried that he would miss there. Glad he didn't, though. Level 19. One more level and he can promote. To warrior. Okay, where's Volk at? There you go. What you got? An L fire. Ooh. Sorin will, Sorin will definitely love that. Let's move left more back here now. Alright, you gotta hit this. Thank you. I'm gonna probably have Ike over here just kind of chilling. Just to make sure nothing dumb happens. And I'm going to heal this guy, of course, because why not? Heal Jill up. Okay, uh... I guess I can move like this. I'll probably have Gator just kind of chill here just to guard this one spot. It's not that useful in this chapter, because for the most part, you, ha you have every other unit. Alright. Alright, so it looks like they're going to be going for the treasure again. 
We are not gonna let them. Can definitely uh well she could kill this dude actually. She honestly can. Okay, that's actually a lot of guys. Okay, she transformed. As expected. Ouch. Uh, I think I can get away with doing this. Okay, that's a level up for Soren, though. So that's alright. Level 17. Resistance. Alright. Defense would have been appreciated, but no. Nah. What's this looking like? Yeah. It's not worth doing that. Blockade the treasure. Can't let them have it. Go, got rid of this dude. Not quite a level up though. Can I not push this guy? Jeez. There we go. Nobody's getting that treasure. They're probably trying to go to this one or this one probably. Hopefully I can beat him out to it. I have Titania rescue this guy. Because he's just kind of in the way. Heal Nephany up. There we go. At least I don't have to worry about her for now. Alright. Oh, he's the barn. Okay, here comes this guy. Nice dodge. Ooh. That was actually pretty good. Okay, I'm a little bit worried about this fire guy, because he could actually do some damage to Boyd. Okay, they went with that. Ah, I wasn't able to get that. Or that one. An energy drop. Yeah, they really want that treasure chest. Okay. That be the way it is, huh? Yeah, I don't want to do that. I guess you can move back down. Go, got a Laguzax. Ooh, that'll be useful. Send that to the convoy. If you kill these guys quick enough, they will drop the items, by the way.
Dang it, really wanted to kill this dude. It's kind of a pain in the neck, to be honest. Should we try it? Screw it. Let's try it. Hopefully, uh, nothing happens here. I don't like that Jill gets doubled here, but oh well. At least she only takes two damage. Iron Bow, she's probably not gonna hit, but you know, something is something, you know. So you see how much XP she got from that? Quite a lot. Okay, uh, let's see. Oh, interesting, you went for Ike. I can no longer level up, so definitely gotta switch things up. Nice. I like how he leveled up his resistance. Ah, I was gonna take that. Bum. That was a speed wing, too. No! Jesus. What? Dang. It's crazy that it had to end like that. I did not think that he would actually... I didn't think he could actually reach like that. I thought he had to get past Gaytree, but no. He actually just flew over it. Huh. Well. Uh. That's uh, the first game over I think I got in this game, to be honest. I didn't think that that would actually happen. But, uh, oh well. I'll, I'll try again tomorrow. I can't try again, again because that just, that just took way too long. But, uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed that. I know it sucks that I got a game over like that, but, uh, all I can do is try again tomorrow. Hopefully it, I can fix that issue. And, uh, see you guys next time. Peace.